Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here's my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look, each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world. My core belief that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the Great Commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith, and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good morning. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an author and addiction recovery coach and life coach and host of this show. The Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version so if you go to YouTube under the channel Take Your Life Back Today show. Listen to Time Hunt Radio, iTunes, Google Music, Amazon Music, and other digital platforms. Friends, Heavenly God, we humbly come before you this morning, first and foremost. And ask you to forgive us of our sins and cleanse all of us of our uh, unrighteousness. So, Lord, we lift up to you, everyone uh, watching and listening to this, that they believe you are the God of the impossible. You can do anything and everything. Help them to trust in your ability and not their own abilities. Teach them to see difficulties in their lives from your perspective this morning. Help them to focus on you and your power. Our responsibility is to carefully read, trust, and obey your word. Today, I pray they bring before you this difficulty in their life. Friends, you are the person asking God for help. Help them to not fear, but to to appreciate everything that God has to offer and, and help them to understand that you are the Almighty God to help them throughout their lives. Help them with their battles, their struggles. You are the mighty, powerful, righteous, and true God. Lord, they have nothing to fear with you on their side. They will be strong and courageous Even in hard times they might be facing right now, they will not be terrified or discouraged. For you, the Lord, our God, will be with them wherever they go. Joshua 1.9 Show them your supernatural powers this morning. Teach them how to walk by faith and pray. Break through prayers as they choose to have faith in your ability to break through every single obstacle they might be facing in their lives. In your name, I pray this. Amen. Call me at 844-405. Help together, you and I. We can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. Remember, send a smile to anyone and change their day, and it can make a difference in your day as well. Have a great day, and remember to always, always ask God for guidance and directions. May God bless each and every one of you watching or listening to me on my podcast and have a great life with Jesus Christ in your life. Take good care and we'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye now. Have a great day.